Welcome to the Lipis Report. Hello, everyone, and welcome to this Lipis Report video podcast that's being recorded at Ixia's iSIM City, where we're testing Brocade's VDX 6700 series and its new VDX 8700 series data center Ethernet switches in its first industry fabric test. Well, I'm Nick Lippis, and I'm joined with Gotham Roy, a product marketing team at Brocade. Well, Brocade has developed a unique approach to data center Ethernet fabric design that supports the flows of both storage and datagram traffic over one physical Ethernet network fabric. Brocade's virtual cluster switching, or VCS fabric technology, delivers the key attributes desired in many of today's data centers, including simplicity or automated provisioning, multipathing, VM aware, scale out, and high performance. VCS is included in Brocade's VDX switch family, including the 6700 and 8700 series. Well, in this video podcast, we show these attributes through live testing. But first, a quick checklist of what's unique about Brocade's VCS fabric built with its VDX 6700 and 8700 series of switches. And they run over 1, 10, and 40 gigabit ethernet. Also, the VDX switches support direct fiber channel and fiber channel over ethernet connections, which reduces cabling and storage switch cost. They support layer three multipathing, where a single VM may have as many as four default gateways distributing load at layer three. There is auto provisioning at layer one, two, and three active-active multipathing. There's 40 gigabit ethernet links between VDX 8700s or core switches to create a high-speed fabric. They're VM aware to support auto provisioning and discovery of VM moves. There's also distributed intelligence where channel access methods are automatically updated to all switches when network changes occur. They're software defined networking ready with VXLAN support and open flow table distribution thanks to its distributed intelligence. Well, these attributes and more enable the brocade VCS fabric to deliver an Ethernet fabric that's auto provisioning, elastic and scalable without the need for large IT operational staff for its management. This video podcast is made up of four segments, including the first one coming up is the architectural approach. Second is gonna be active, active and auto provisioning attributes of the fabric. Third, virtual machine, join, move and also remove and show the simplicity of it. And then the fourth will end with fabric skin. That concludes this edition of the Lipis Report. Thank you for joining us. Look for us every Tuesday and Thursday. To get your free subscription to the Lipis Report newsletter, go to www.lipis.com. To sponsor the Lipis Report podcast, send email to sales at lipis.com. We've got to go, and so do you. See you next time.